Hey folks, Doc here. Apologies for shooting on my cell phone. This is not the day I need to be dragging a pile of video equipment around. But today's a bit of a momentous day for the first time in, oh, I don't know, three years? Yeah, that's right. Diesel Weasel has come out of storage. That's right, there it is. All dressed up and ready to go. I have had Diesel Weasel sitting in a tarped crate outside. Uh, you know, I've checked on it a couple of times, but I've had it sitting in that crate for at least three years. Maybe three and a half? I don't know, it's been a while. I last showed this at uh, a Halloween car show and I think it was 2017. I might have had it out early in 18, I don't remember. But yeah, I crammed it in that crate. It's been sitting there since because I've been busy with other stuff. And uh, now that things are starting to loosen up after all this COVID stupidity, uh, I've decided that since we have a car show today, I'm gonna bring her out. So, there is, you know, a little bit of rust in a few places, but then again, it's a rat rod. So, rust isn't exactly out of place. Does it run? Yes, absolutely. The battery that I've got tucked under the seat, that AGM that came out of a booster pack, is absolutely stone dead. There was nothing I could do to bring it back. But with a boost, this thing lights right up. Um, after three years in the crate, it lit right up. Uh, starting was instantaneous. It was like the day I parked it. It was awesome. So, <clears throat> I don't know if I'm going to really get a chance to run it today. I'm displaying it at this car show with the Highway 11 Cruisers Car Club. So I may not get a chance to run it. It's more like just put it on display with a sign kind of thing. I'll get you some footage from the show. And depending on what time I get back, if I still have enough light to do everything I've got to do, I might take it for a loop around the neighborhood or something like that. So stick around, I'm gonna get off to the show and uh, I'll try and get you some show footage. Okay, so my apologies, I'm gonna to have to swap in some royalty-free music uh, because of the copyright laws and the fact that the car show was playing copyrighted music. Don't wanna get my peepee -pee slapped by YouTube. Okay, so guys, I've been uh, parking and registering cars all day long. This is only, oh, not even a quarter of the show, so I gotta be real quick here. I haven't had time to film anything, and I kind of apologize. I was sort of hoping to shoot a hell of a lot more, but they've been keeping me busy, boy, howdy. Anyways, yeah, great turnout today. Got the Ontario Mustang Club out here, which is why I'm completely surrounded by Mustangs at this moment. 
This is like maybe a quarter of the show. It's fantastic. Well, the car show was a success. Weasel got a lot of attention. There were over a thousand cars registered and we raised a lot of money for charity, which is what our car club does. Um, quite a lot of money. If there was a thousand cars registered at 10 bucks a crack, you can do the math on that. Plus it was a 50-50 draw that was good for a couple of grand, you know, half of 50-50. We did really good. But I didn't get to do so much. So I apologize for that. But I think I'm going to take Weasel for a loop around the block just for kicks and giggles. Good Sunday with the weasel, a good Sunday with the car club, some really nice, hot, gorgeous weather, awesome cars, great people, and uh, I really enjoyed myself, and I, I'm glad I could share at least a little bit of it with you. Like I said, I'm sorry I couldn't film more. They kept me freaking busy. I had cars coming out my wazoo. Anyways, thanks for tuning in to Sprocket's Garage, and until next time, take care of yourself. <laughs>